And a few seconds later, it generated a org chart in Figma. And I can go full screen without ever leaving ChatGPT, create an org chart in Figma for a fictional AI company that generates a billion dollars per year. And you can see, basically it just described what the org chart would look like, but Notice at the bottom here, it gave me a little prompt that says use Figma for the answer. So because I didn't Figma, it didn't do it with Figma, but it suggested that I use Figma. So now if I click this, you can see that it added Figma as the tool, but it also started to just go ahead and use Figma. Now it's asking me to connect to my Figma account. So I'll continue, approve, Figma is now connected. And a few seconds later, it generated a org chart in Figma. And I can go full screen without ever leaving ChatGPT. We can see here's our CEO, Alex Chen, our CPO, CFO, CLO, et cetera. It, it built out the org chart and all I did was prompt it to do this. I could either open this in Figma now, like so, and it's in my Figma account, or I could make changes to it directly inside of ChatGPT. Add another layer of employees to the org chart. Now it's generating a fig jam diagram. And as we can see, it added another layer of employees underneath. I didn't do anything other than just tell it to with chat.